This phenomenon is called learned helplessness, and a great deal of work has shown how learned helplessness alters human health and behavior. Believing that nothing you do matters and that you have no control over what happens to you directly influences what you do. If you believe your actions are futile, why would you even try to look for alternative ways to solve a problem? As you can imagine, learned helplessness makes it much more likely a person develops mental health problems like anxiety and depression, as well as academic problems and risky behaviors like substance abuse. But let's not stop on the negative side of the coin. Other experiments looked at whether learned helplessness could be changed. For example, in a follow-up experiment, Seligman and Mayer taught the learned helpless dogs how to escape the shock by jumping over the wall. From that point forward, these dogs never just sat there again, and 100% were able to escape the shock in future experiments. This phenomenon is called learned optimism, and it is the foundation of resilience. To be resilient, you must learn and believe that your actions are meaningful and that you have personal control over your life. In the face of new stressors and negative life events, resilient people won't give up. They'll keep trying and find a way to adapt, adjust, and probably learn from the experience. What about you?